Hi, I'm Andrew Rudin from the Daily Collegian, and this is our post-game wrap-up from Penn State's 52-0 beatdown of Akron in their season opener. So I'm staying here, 39-yard line, where DeAndre Tompkins fielded the punt that turned into Penn State's first punt return since Derek Williams stayed up in Madison against Wisconsin in 2008. So it's hard to take a lot away from a season opener against a MAC team for, you know, a Big Ten team that's number six in the country going into the season. But there are definitely some positives for James Franklin and his staff to carry into Pitt for next week. One of which being the offensive line, which looked much improved. A year ago against Kent State in the season opener against a MAC team, they weren't able to really run the ball at will. They were today. Second, Saquon Barkley's informed the Mount Heisman campaign and compete for the trophy all the way through the season. The guy was phenomenal. He was phenomenal at back, out of the backfield. He was phenomenal catching the ball. He had a good reception on a wheel route, a good catch and run that got Penn State a first down in the red zone. And then second of all, on the offense is Juwan Johnson looks the breakout star that he's been the talk of all camp and all offseason. He ended with nearly 100 receiving yards, and he could looks like he could replace a lot of the production that Chris Godwin left. And then moving on to the defensive side of the football, the front seven looked good. The Cawthorn brothers in the middle, I think, got a lot more push than they got a year ago. I think Penn State, some positives to take away. Pitt next week, their first real test of the season.